Test 8. Part 1. Look at Part 1. Now we are ready to start. For each question, choose the correct answer. 1. What is dangerous about the weather tonight? Now for the weather in your area. Many of you have had very cold and wet days. But finally, there's no more fog in the area. And after the heavy snowfall at the beginning of the week, the rain today washed most of the snow away. The wet roads will freeze again tonight as the temperatures will drop this evening. So be very careful if you are going to school or work on foot tomorrow. We'll be back after six o'clock with more news about the condition of the roads in the area. Now listen again. Now for the weather in your area. Many of you have had very cold and wet days. But finally, there's no more fog in the area. And after the heavy snowfall at the beginning of the week, the rain today washed most of the snow away. The wet roads will freeze again tonight, as the temperatures will drop this evening. So be very careful if you are going to school or work on foot tomorrow. We'll be back after six o'clock with more news about the condition of the roads in the area. Two. What's the time? Hurry up. We'll be late for the concert at John's school. He has been reminding us about the concert for two weeks now. Don't worry. We have plenty of time. It doesn't start for another half an hour. No, it starts at 7.45. We have to leave now. As soon as it starts, they will close the doors. Oh, I thought it started much later. We've got ten minutes to get there. If we don't arrive on time, John and his teacher will be very angry with us. Now listen again. Hurry up. We'll be late for the concert at John's school. He has been reminding us about the concert for two weeks now. Don't worry. We have plenty of time. It doesn't start for another half an hour. No, it starts at 7.45. We have to leave now. As soon as it starts, they will close the doors. Oh, I thought it started much later. We've got ten minutes to get there. If we don't arrive on time, John and his teacher will be very angry with us. Three. Where are they going? Hi, George. Just calling to say I can't wait till tomorrow. You know, I've never seen this sort of performance live before. I must tell you, I love the story. And there are some really famous actors too. I think one of the actors was in that film we saw at the cinema last week. They'll be right there in the same room with us. Can you believe it? I'm so excited. But I also wanted to ask you something. What time did Miss Jones tell us to meet at school to get there in time? Let me know. Now listen again. Hi, George. Just calling to say I can't wait till tomorrow. You know, I've never seen this sort of performance live before. I must tell you, I love the story. And there are some really famous actors too. I think one of the actors was in that film we saw at the cinema last week. They'll be right there in the same room with us. Can you believe it? I'm so excited. But I also wanted to ask you something. What time did Miss Jones tell us to meet at school to get there in time? Let me know. Four. Where will the boy go first after school? Hi, Jim. Shall I meet you at the gym after school? My mum has asked me to do some shopping first as we've got no food in the fridge. We need bread, milk and cheese. We also need some fish and meat. If I don't go, we'll have to eat out and mum doesn't want that at all. OK. I'll go home first and then we can go to the gym together after you've put the shopping away. I hope it doesn't take you too long or we'll be late again. Now listen again. Hi Jim. Shall I meet you at the gym after school? 
My mum has asked me to do some shopping first, as we've got no food in the fridge. We need bread, milk, and cheese. We also need some fish and meat. If I don't go, we'll have to eat out, and mum doesn't want that at all. Okay, I'll go home first, and then we can go to the gym together after you've put the shopping away. I hope it doesn't take you too long, or we'll be late again. Five. How did the girl break her arm? Oh no! What happened to you? You look terrible. My dad was driving me to school when a cyclist fell off her bike in front of us. Goodness! Did you hit her? No. We managed to stop very quickly, just in time. It was very lucky that we didn't hit her. While I was getting out of the car, a dog walked in front of me and tripped me up. Unfortunately, I landed on my left arm and broke it. Then my dad had to take me to the hospital. Now listen again. Oh no! What happened to you? You look terrible. My dad was driving me to school when a cyclist fell off her bike in front of us. Goodness! Did you hit her? No. We managed to stop very quickly, just in time. It was very lucky that we didn't hit her. While I was getting out of the car, a dog walked in front of me and tripped me up. Unfortunately, I landed on my left arm and broke it. Then my dad had to take me to the hospital. Six. Where is the remote control? Bill, you look very upset. What are you looking for? The remote control for the television should be on the TV where we normally leave it. Have you looked on the armchair? That's where you were sitting last night. Yes, Mum. I've also looked on and under the coffee table. I even looked behind the armchair. I can't find it anywhere, and the football match starts in two minutes. Here it is. You can't have looked very well. It was right where we always keep it. Now listen again. Bill, you look very upset. What are you looking for? The remote control for the television should be on the TV where we normally leave it. Have you looked on the armchair? That's where you were sitting last night. Yes, Mum. I've also looked on and under the coffee table. I even looked behind the armchair. I can't find it anywhere, and the football match starts in two minutes. Here it is. You can't have looked very well. It was right where we always keep it. Seven. Where are they staying on holiday this year? Mum, I'm so glad we decided not to go camping this year. I didn't enjoy it at all last year. Yes, the bad weather was a real problem, wasn't it? It rained non-stop for a whole week. The cruise wouldn't have been much fun either because of the big storms last summer. No, it wouldn't. I didn't think I'd be so glad to be staying in a hotel. It seems like I'll never get used to our adventure holidays. Anyway, what's important is that we'll be protected from the weather if it gets bad. Now listen again. Mum, I'm so glad we decided not to go camping this year. I didn't enjoy it at all last year. Yes, the bad weather was a real problem, wasn't it? It rained non-stop for a whole week. The cruise wouldn't have been much fun either because of the big storms last summer. No, it wouldn't. I didn't think I'd be so glad to be staying in a hotel. It seems like I'll never get used to our adventure holidays. Anyway, what's important is that we'll be protected from the weather if it gets bad. That is the end of part one.